Venom Hunt. Uh, not that one. Need that Paragon's Townhouse, which is pretty close. Suppose I should do the Mag Magic Guild task at some point. Perinal. Okay, he reads interesting stuff. In what case are you? Here seen. Friends, I can't wait to hear the results of your investigations. Okay. History of skin grad. I always look into people's bookshelves. They are actually telling telling about people who own, own them. Truth about Green Pact. Read. Don't mean that I might if I <laughs> look, look around. Slightly dark here. Nicknames and by names. Sorry, Peragon, but we are going to like a judge your house. Wow. So he has his own. Exhibition here, museum even. Okay. What are you doing? Uh, I've been collecting stuff. Okay, that's a casit. Sword and mace, an axe. Balcony. Bedroom. He is doing quite nicely. believe we found a corrupted seed at Ostamir, that the recollection somehow caused the new forest to overgrow Westweald, or that my friend Sorolin was involved. Leramil wants to talk to you, but I'd like to hear what else you've discovered. An invasion launched from Rostwall Estate would have taken Skingrad completely by surprise. I'm glad that you and the Tribune were there to stop them. But the recollection working with Daedra? That's a troubling new development. By reputation, we only just met. I know she does troubleshooting for Count Calantius, so I figured I might run into her eventually. She apparently heard about me too. Just showed up on my doorstep. You learn anything else out there? Ethelia, the Daedric Prince you and Laramil are looking for? Yep. You met her? Incredible! But why is the Recollection looking for her? Didn't they? Uh, never mind. I think you should talk to Laramil now. I need to consider all this. So, okay, so even the closest Daedra of Ithelia can't find her. Our initial investigations are complete, Proxy. Let us speak. Encountering a material confirmation of. That is, I thought it would take longer for us to find and confront Ithelia in person. 
We determined that my suspicions about the frayed fates proved correct. Each location had a connection to Athelia. That the recollection and the Miramor Daedra seek to restore Athelia to power. They cause the new forest and wildburn devastation. And Athelia wanders west wield, starting to remember. For helping me reach these conclusions, take this reward. So Daedra Beast itself isn't actually controlling her followers. But <laughs> they are acting on their own. Uh, boots, nice. Okay, pre vintage. Speak with Baragon. See if he has a thought about our next steps. Athelia's presence untethers all consequences. It makes it nearly impossible for me to perceive the threads of fate, let alone determine which threads to follow. Most people do not bear the responsibility of preserving reality itself. If we guess wrong about what we must do, or simply fail to do it, disaster ensues. I do not like to leave such decisions to chance when the stakes are so high. Trust in Baragon's knowledge of the recollection. There is an anomaly I wish to look into while you and he pursue the cultists and ferret out their plans. Perhaps the wildburn seed you found in Ostermere is the place to start. I shall find you later. I've been thinking about Ostemir and your investigations with Laramil and Tribunalea. The recollection was involved each time. We need to determine what they're planning next. Maybe the Wildburn seed we found in Ostemir can help us do that. I'm not a green speaker or a spinner, but I know a corrupted seed when I see one. If we can trace it to its source, I think we can find the recollection. Luckily, there are experts on this sort of thing close by, in the Wood Elf town of Vashabar. So it, it, it is a Daedric corruption, but how they can tra trace it? Okay, interesting. Bosma, who honored the green, wouldn't have anything to do with a Wildburn seed. But I want to show the seed we recovered to a green speaker. If they can tell us more about it, it might lead us right to the recollection. Help me, and I'll pay your way. Here, just to be safe, you should carry the Wildburn Seed. Greenspeaker Derelith and Vashabar should be able to tell us something about it. Just follow the gold road into Dawnwood and turn north. Tribunalea and I will meet you there. This house is enormous. I know, it's too much. During my adventuring days, I helped a wealthy Colovian family. They rewarded me with the deed to a grand old empty townhouse. I had enough gold to make this place livable, and it seemed a waste not to use it. I've lived all over Tamriel, and Skingrad is a nice enough city. Always something happening here, and we get news from across the continent. It wasn't until recently that the people of Westweald started looking askance at Wood Elves. Since the appearance of the New Forest, what the Bosmer of Vashabar called Dawnwood, the rest of Westweald has grown nervous and suspicious of all Wood Elves. I've lived here for years, but suddenly I'm an outsider. Things could get ugly. Yes, I'm confused by that as well. Green speakers are mages who work within the Green Pact to shape the forest to meet their needs. Every Wood Elf village has a green speaker to grow new pod homes or shape useful tools. It's an art my people cherish. You saw what I saw at Ostermere. My old friend Sorlene has lost her way. If she had a hand in the use of Wildburn seeds, then she's turned her back on the Green Pact. I'm not sure she can do that and still call herself a green speaker. My best guess is that the Recollection is a revival of an ancient Aeliad cult. The Aeliads didn't just vanish when their empire fell. Many found shelter in the surrounding lands. Some Wood Elves believe they're descendants of that heritage. So Aeliads are called Wild Elves and they're, they're still like in a, in a fourth era. There's like st st still like at least one 
alive. As far as I can tell, the recollection didn't even exist a year ago. It's like hundreds of people woke up one day and decided to join a new cult. They're convinced something has been taken from them. Something they'll do anything to reclaim. Plundering ancient ruins. Recruiting other people who feel lost. Mostly wood elves, but not exclusively. Whatever it is the recollection thinks they're missing, it's made them desperate. And dangerous. And we know they're working with Daedra, too. I don't know if it's a good idea to take that seed to Vashabar. We could be handing it right back to the Recollection. Who knows how many friends they have there. Not exactly. While he agreed to spare a few legionaries to patrol the area, he's reluctant to assign more troops there on a permanent basis. Not after I lost an entire cohort. He ordered me to continue my investigation, though, so here I am. When we learned that the Recollection was working with Daedra at Rustwall, it seemed my clearest path forward was to find an expert. Retired adventurer, former Imperial scribe, Recollection scholar. I probably should have visited Baragon sooner. They both showed up in Westweald around the same time. Oh, I don't think every wood elf in Vashabar is a member of the Recollection, but some must be. It doesn't help that they occupy a new forest that appeared on land that doesn't belong to them. Sure, the new forest sprang up in a part of Westfield that was mostly wild and uninhabited, but it's still part of the province. No one in Vashabar swears allegiance to Count Calantius. What's he supposed to make of that? I'm not concerned about lines on a map. People are getting hurt. The devastated area at the border of the forest is ruining farms and spawning dangerous beasts. Not to mention the attacks by the Recollection. Someone needs to answer for all this. Okay. Let's, let's head back to the road. Ah, uh, there's a battle over there. Yeah. Let's see if we can make it. Okay, so you need to wait, wait it to start. No need. Okay, okay, it started. Kill those first that keep the shields up. Basically, this is the same mechanic than uh, in, in the introductory.
nothing interesting except skill shred and take fragment. Macabre vintage ring. We could have told that, you know. Pretend you never saw me, traveler. Who? <laughs> I don't want to bother you. I'm looking to get away from the war in Cyrodiil, but don't know where to go. No, it, no, I'm all right. I mean, I'm not, but it's better for both of us if you just moved on. I deserted my post in Cyrodiil. I'm on the run. You could get in trouble for speaking to me. That's why I'm out here. I've got nowhere to go. The Legion watches the city for deserters, and they consider anyone who fights on the side of one of the Alliances to be a traitor and a criminal. I dare not even go back to my family. I'm not Interesting. Sure. I need to leave these lands. <laughs> Maybe board a ship in Anvil and go somewhere where I won't be recognized. But we shouldn't discuss this. I'm going to find a ship out of Anvil. Perhaps we'll meet again in the West, Traveler. That's I interesting. If the troopers are actually deserting in the mass, that means that Alliance War is going really, really, really badly. Okay, so this is the uh, Bosmer habitation and this is the <laughs> Imperial. So you can probably craft something here. Tariker strike set. That's damage. Dealing damage to the fully charged heavy attack grants you major major berserk for se se four seconds, increasing your damage down by ten. Can occur every one second. So a as f as long as you do the fully charged. Strike, which is totally, totally slow. Uh, I, I don't, I don't feel, feel it. Okay, so this is a boss. Okay, now I understand. So they are growing the houses like, like this, and these have been growing like a couple months. And we have seen in Valenwood the finished ones. Troll is a pretty bad customer. Okay. That was some lag. The wild burn animals are inhabiting the houses. Ah, there's a Recollection Town. Humor of the <laughs> wood elves. <laughs> I would like some broth meth and a mop. <laughs> we did the monkey follow tea. It was dead. What is brown and sticky? A stick. <laughs> They're pretty good. Why the bees bees pass? Because they can't whistle. Come join a righteous cause, my friend. The Of Merry Dominion has room for everyone in its ranks. That's all right. We all make mistakes <laughs> sometimes. The Of Merry Dominion is forgiving to its members, even with nonsense like the fighting over the Green Pact and the Dawnway. <laughs> well, some clans here hold tight to the Green Pact, but others follow a new path, the Dawnway. They both have merit, but the faithful on either side Dawn don't Bay. see it that way. I expect more from Dominion folk than petty arguments. <laughs> okay.
Okay. Uh, Dawnway. So cream pack is going to be replaced. It's an ancient wood elf custom handed down from Ifre himself. We protect the green, and in return, it provides for us. There's more to it, but that's the gist. I agree with whatever is best for the Dominion. Let each clan choose the path that suits them. This bickering is a distraction from real problems. But I shouldn't be telling you this. I'm supposed to be recruiting right now. It's the ancient heritage of the wild elves, the Aeliads. They worked with natural materials in the forest, picking fruit from trees and harvesting the wood sometimes. I don't see a problem with it, but it's caused quite a stir. Yeah, I wonder. Picking fruits. Bad, 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 bad. We're done here. Agreed, you arse. Here for his bone. Fine. Real rotten ruin of all the days. I'm sorry you had to see that traveller. Our family drama is a poor welcome to Vashabar. Those two old timber pigs were our fathers. My beloved Clendigal and I simply can't get them to see reason. We want to be married. And our fathers, trees take them, won't hear of it. You just saw the backside of an argument we've had many times. This was the last. Clen and I are going to leave. Start a new life. Can... Can I ask a favor? I have coin. They don't see eye to eye on anything. It's like they want to grind each other into bone meal. Long story. Maybe they do. If you're inclined, find my Agawen Cyril and tell her we're leaving. We need supplies and she might be willing to help us. Cyril's my aunt. She owns the beer garden at the center of town. You can't miss her. Beer garden. Ifrae the singer himself must have sent you. Thank you, traveler. You said your fathers want to grind each other into bone meal. I'm slightly exaggerating. But while the language of my people is expressive and beautiful, we have no word for fundamentally disagree with to the point of violence. My father's a green speaker and devout follower of the Green Pact. Clendigal's father is an important envoy for King Nantharian's Dawnway. Okay. If they were so worried about appearances, they'd have punched each other in the bits by now. They hated our match long before we crossed the River Strid and Vashabar was grown. But the last few months have been tense to the point of breaking. We tried one last blighted time to convince them, as you saw, and failed spectacularly, damn it. Ah, oh, what a brilliant idea! Oh, sorry. Perhaps where you're from, that's an option, but not for us. Without the blessing of our fathers, not a soul in Vashabar would accept our union. That's just how we are. We've plenty of family friends, but no one like that. Oak and Burl. Clen and I both lost our mothers when we were young. It's one of the things that drew us together. We need our fathers to consent. Or we need to leave. It's our newly grown home. We're a clan of wood elves, originally from Valenwood. We follow the Green Pact, but a number of us support the Dawnway as well. We crossed the River Strid when the forest of Valenwood extended into West Weald. Depends who you ask. Some believe the Green grew the forest and led us here to establish Vashabar. Those who follow the Dawnway see it as a sign we were meant to reclaim the land of our ancestors. Provided you believe we're descended from Aeliads. I'm slightly exaggerating. But while the language of my people is expressive and beautiful, we have no word for fundamentally disagree with to the point of violence. <laughs> My father's a green speaker and devout follower of the okay, green. Pact. Okay, okay. Lots of repeating in this game. Green. We shape the living wood that make up our homes. It's an ancient art form, and I'm proud to carry on the tradition. Vashabar would never have grown without my father and his magic. Obstinate old Ash. It's our newly grown home. We're a clan of wood elves, originally from Balin Wood. We follow the Green Pact, but a number of us. <laughs> It's a family nickname for my Aunt Cyril. Agawen means something like wise woman. I think it's an old joke between her and my father. In kinder times, he encouraged us to appreciate our culture and use our language. 
<laughs> Most days, proud, actually. I'm training to be a green speaker myself, following along the leaf trail of my father and his father before him. Obstinate old grat oak that he is. I love him, damn it. I just wish he'd listen to me. Okay. So this is the new Wood Elf village. They basically they are living in the house that's being grown. Look, I know it doesn't look appetizing, but I promise my scamp gut rotmith will change scamp your gut. life. Or at least your taste buds. It leaves a very strong taste in the mouth. I'm still balancing the flavors. Scamp gut. Wild hunt horse. What? How this can be? Yeah, I know what the wild hunt is, but that's like, what? Falling is the fateful totem elk. Okay. I wonder where is Falling Serving as one of our Karak's few ambassadors is a true honor. He leapt at the chance to send someone to this fledgling kingdom. I was fortunate to win the post. So Reachman <laughs> sent him away. Okay. Listening to Ambassador Gorinwi has been enlightening. I had no idea the Reach folk were such accomplished healers. Well, they get wounded a lot. Okay. Okay, so some of them live underground. My research here continues to yield results. Insights like these mean I'll be able to continue my studies in the Imperial City. With any luck, I'll never have to return to my old stronghold. I prefer to leave the brute force to others. I wonder if, if the Imperial City has been taken back from Daedra. Probably. If this implies. That it's returning to normal work is good. I swear it. I've become much better at remembering things like taking measurements and sewing up the seams of trousers. By the green, I'm something of an artist at this point. Welcome, traveller. This is the Vashabar Garden of Ale. I'm the owner and host, Cyril. Did I hear Ray's voices just now? Was that Lainey and her father? Green preserve me. My brother Nidalee and old Mint are the problem here, sure enough. They've never seen eye to eye. But since Vashabar grew, their views have petrified like ancient bark. Neither will bend, but it's the lovelies who suffer. Ah, easy enough. I, I'll do it. But look, <laughs> Lainey yep. and Clendigal deserve love and their village both. Yep. He, she you knows. talk to those old goats? Tell them their children plan to leave. Maybe that will make them finally see reason. Hmm. How can you... Ah, I have just the thing. Take these. I brewed up a few casks of Jaga earlier this week. Offer them a drink. And maybe they'll be more inclined to listen. I'll be over by the stables when you're done. Uh, yeah, guys, fermented milk, so. Those old manners should be in pod houses around the village. And don't worry if they get cranky. They're more bark than branch, if you take my meaning. Of course. You're kind to involve yourself in affairs of the heart like this. 
family, tradition, belief. You're my brother. What a mess. I want them to be happy, sap sweet as that is. They've put off their own plans for years now, first supporting their fathers and then the village. If they want to stand and be married, if Frey himself couldn't dissuade me. Since we were kids, I've been trying to get Nedalir to listen to reason. He may be a pillar of the community now, but to me, he'll always be my little brother. He thinks he's teasing me by calling me a wise woman, but I secretly love it. In Valenwood, the oldest trees are revered, but the long shadows they cast can strangle saplings before they take root. Minth and Nedalir are much the same. They're giants, but we need new growth to secure the future. Pig's milk, oh, pig's primarily. Milk. It's my own recipe, so there's a bit of this and a bit of that in there for flavor and body. If you like that, you should taste my rot meth. Uh, please don't. I've been brewing a batch for Lainey's wedding ceremony since she was a baby. That's pretty old. One rot meth. Pungent, hopeful smelling beverage. Made prima primarily from fermented meat. There's old ruins around. What exactly are you implying, Colovian? I'm not implying. I'm saying it outright. Okay, she's this land here again. Wasn't yours to grow a forest over. That's enough <laughs> tribute. <laughs> Fine. You and the mercenary handle it. Apologies, Green Speaker. What can you tell us about the seed my friend is carrying? A Colovian soldier can't just stroll into our town and throw around accusations. If not for Beragon, he may not be part of our settlement, but his good works are known to us. Well, what is it? What did you does he? Well, let me take a look. Hmm. This appears to be a green spring seed, but it's unlike any that I've ever worked with before. It's infused with strange energy. What's a green spring seed? Green spring seeds are what green singers use to grow new sections of forest and shape them into enclosures and settlements. We use some to create Vashabar, but this one is corrupted. Still, something familiar. Wait, I've sensed this before. I was out exploring. Dawnwood may be a blessing, but I'm curious as to its origin. And the devastated area troubles me. I ran into wood elves with a covered cart. There was a whiff of strange magic about it. It must have been one of these seeds. Here, I'll mark your map. I met the Wood Elves with a covered car in the hills east of Left Wheel. If you find more of these corrupted seeds, burn them. And don't worry, I'll destroy the one you gave me after I finish examining it. We had nothing to do with the appearance of Dawnwood. King Nantharian tells us that it is a natural extension of Valenwood. That its sudden growth is proof that we are meant to reclaim our rightful heritage of this land. Dawnwood is what we call this new forest. Valenwood lies to the south, just across the Strid River. King Nantharian gathered Bosmer, who wanted a fresh start and took advantage of the new forest to build the Vashabar settlement. That makes no sense. No ritual I know of can make a forest grow so quickly. If the corrupted Greenspring seed, this Wildburn seed, is capable of that, I really must study it. I need to determine if the seed's taint has spread into the green. Corruption and strange energy you sense, do you know what it is? I need to conduct tests, make a detailed study. But if I had to guess, I think it carries a whiff of Daedric magic. Duh. It could explain the unprecedented explosion of energy and the area of devastation along the border. The wild burn. The Tribune sees a threat in the eyes of every Bosma. But she may not be wrong. I've heard rumors, secret gatherings, elves taken up paths walked before we accepted the Green Pact. Some who follow the Dawnway may be tied to the recollection. Our new settlement consists of two Bosma factions, those who observe the Green Pact 
and those who follow the Dawnway. These elves cultivate crops and harvest wood, but they would never abuse the Green's gifts by corrupting a Green Spring ritual. We wood elves are children of the Green. Long ago, we swore to never harm the living forest. We do not cut wood or pluck fruit. In exchange, the forest shelters us and shapes itself to our needs. Those who follow the Dawnway walk a different path. Yep. That can be... Now that she mentioned it, I've heard of green spring seeds. If the recollection was able to corrupt the sacred seeds of the green with Daedric magic, that's unthinkable. That should like Before break we the green back. Cart, we should talk to King Nantharian first. King Nantharian's an interesting person, charismatic, a visionary. He saw an opportunity and rallied Wood Elves to follow him and start this settlement. As I understand it, he leans toward the Dawnway more than the Green. We need to warn him that his followers are in danger. While drawing Wood Elves away from the Green is next to impossible, Green Speaker Sorolin notwithstanding, the followers of the Dawnway are ripe to be recruited by the Recollection. Okay, King's Residence. But I need to talk to the fathers of this. Okay, so it's it's a big big resonance over here. Uh, all right. How do you like living without roof? If race needs a stranger, welcome. What can this old green speaker do for you? My sister sent you. Yeah, <laughs> with Jaga no less, eh? Well, what's my sister up to this time? Eh, well. I'll drink with you, stranger, and I'll hear what you have to say. Cyril does make some mighty fine jogger. Rabbit dung! Lanny will be our next green speaker. Has she never abandoned her duty to the green? Damn mint and his dawn waste spawn! Are there weeds in our garden? I won't allow this marriage. I'll make that clear to Lanny. As soon as I finish this jogger. Okay, that went pretty badly. Some writers have clearly been putting um, their own life stories into into last uh, expansions because because some some stories seem to be way too close to uh, to real life or how the family mem members can affect affect each other. Ah, a visitor to our fair village. Perhaps you'd like to hear about the Dawnway. The new path forward for Bosma and Vashabar. I can tell you all about it. Jaga? From Cyril? For me? What's this all about, stranger? Maybe he sh should, er, uh, she should uh, give, <laughs> let them drink first before talking about it. Ridiculous. Glendagall belongs here. I want him to see the world from the top of the canopy, not the bottom of the forest floor. To see the world as our King Nantharian sees it. Our King plans for the future, for our people, for Vashabar. No, he can't marry the daughter of a Green Speaker. The outdated customs of the Green Pact have held my people back for far too long. I understand what you and Cyril tried to do here, but my mind is made up. Now excuse me, I need to find my son. There you are. I've got a good start on gathering supplies for Laney and Clendergol. How was your chat with the old goats? Those two could give lessons in cussedness to a timber mammoth. Cuss cussedness. And now they'll be looking for the loving couple. Damn. My niece can't leave. If only... Hmm. If their fathers won't budge, can we convince Laney and Clendergol to stay? I know those two. They'd never be happy as outcasts. If they stay, there's always a chance we can sort this out. I still need to work on these supplies. 
Would you be willing to talk to some friends of the families? Get them to encourage patience. Hmm. Gandelian. He's Lainey's grove father. Helped her walk for the first time. Ah, a Melaniel. Clendigal's tutor with a blade. Both of them should be nearby. Thank you, traveller. There's a stiff brew with your name on it once we get this sorted. Uh, not the Rotomath bee, please. Visitor on a mission, like a ringtail after a beetle. A new face in Vashavar, beautiful like the pelt of a sense tiger cub, fresh from the den and curious about the world. What? <laughs> no! What? No! All of a sudden I'm back, holding Lainey's hand as she takes a shaky step like a fawn in a glade. Oh, my heart. This is because of their fathers, isn't it? Nedalia, you foolish old man. Ugh, I can't, stranger. I'm sorry. I teach the children if they want to leave, they should. It would be wrong to say different to Lainey. Oh, I'm like a litter of fisher pups on the inside. All flailing limbs and lashing tails. I can't believe Lainey thinks she has to leave town. Her father will be heartbroken. If raised tears, I'll be heartbroken. Okay. Oh, thank you for asking. I'm a part of the Valenwood Faithful, an aide to the green speakers, advisor to spinners, and tutor for the village children. Would you like to hear my favorite thing about the <laughs> favorite green Favorite thing? What's your favorite thing about green pact? People in distant lands like to focus on our eating habits, or what we think about fallen trees. The truth is, the green pact <laughs> is a way of inviting the Candy forest palism. into our lives, into our heart. And that just makes me so happy. Okay. Of course! Green speaking is a beautiful art, an extension of the deepest mysteries in Ifray worship. Some mages use it like you'd wield a hammer, as a tool. In our clan, we dedicate ourselves fully to hearing the singer, to weaving the trees. Oh, <laughs> no! Not everyone has the aptitude for magic. Or perhaps, like a songbird in the highest branch, the storyteller's tune is too faint to hear. But for those with the gift, we celebrate it in a way few still do in Valenwood. <laughs> many things. Oh, many things. Children don't know not to be curious, you see. A timber pig in a truffle den. Geography, politics, the ways of the green. I'm even a fair hand at cooking when I put my mind to it. I have to wear many hats. Hats on hats. <laughs> We're a small community. And we want our children to make good choices, to be ready for the world. And if they choose to leave someday, well, perhaps they will return and bring the world back with them. Okay, that wasn't too helpful. No one without good cause. Babbler, are you looking to practice the blade? In the mood for a sparring match? Glendigal, leave. But the village is freshly grown. And it feels like just yesterday I was helping him choose a training blade. I know how much he loves that young woman. If they think they have to leave town to be married, well... No, I'm sorry. If they want to go, I respect their decision. But... Hmm... Maybe old Spinnabel Wellis might be able to help you. He's keeper of the Wilderhall here in Vashabar. Nope, nobody can help <laughs> in this quest. The Donway teaches us that knowledge of the past can build a path to the future. 
Our Wilder Hall holds all the old knowledge of our clan. Wilder Maybe there's Hall. something in there that could help Laney and Clendigal find happiness. Maybe there's still some way forward here. What is a marriage but a hope for a better tomorrow? And Vashabar itself is a symbol of hope. I'm an accomplished blade dancer and work with Minth as an envoy of the Dawnway. Before we left Valenwood, I taught everyone who asked the way of the sword. Wish I'd had a chance to do more. Bit of a pompous term for someone that's good at fighting with a sword, innit? I heard it from a high elf in mixed training at a Dominion base. I kinda liked it, so I made it my own. With my whole heart. I saw more than enough during my time with the Dominion military to know we need a better tomorrow. A glimmering dawn on the horizon. Okay, so she has been in, in a dom Dominion as well. What are my soldiers and... Ah, soldiers the leaving outsider. their posts. How goes your quest? Badly. I've seen you running to and fro, traveler. On a quest to help our young couple, I believe. How goes the journey? Nedolia will not bend. Minth will not sway. They revere our culture, but learn nothing from the trees. If the couple chooses to leave, I will not speak against them. Every living being must be allowed to grow as it wills. So says Ifri, so say I. It is a repository of knowledge from Valenwood, a connection to the deep history of our people. I hoped the singer might send you my way. I believe a text from the hall may offer a solution. Seek out a scroll called the Rite of Propagation. It allows a Bosma community to determine its future, to step in where growth has stagnated. If Laney and Clendigal perform the right, Vashabar can make its voice known. And not even Nedalia or Minth can silence the voice of the village. So meaning voice, voice of the nature. The Wilder Hall is just east of here. The right may be just what Laney and Clendigal need, what Vashabar needs. I suggest you take it over to Cyril when you find the text. She'll be instrumental in enacting the rite. Of course, it is an ancient rite, rarely practiced today. From a time when the supporting branches and vines of culture and custom could, on occasion, strangle new growth in its bed. The people of the... I doubt they know it exists. Both of them came in to read the text on occasion, but they live busy lives. The past is not Laney's focus, and Clendigal's mind drifts to much more ancient days. I am a healer, a scholar, and a spinner. By aiding the people of Vashabar, I tend to the future. As keeper of the Wilderhall, I tend to the past. You could say that. As a healer, I assisted in both their births. Laney took command of the room the moment she drew breath. Clendigal came out fighting. I was also there when they lost their mothers. For every bright day, there is a dark one. Why not me? I'm of the opinion that if you believe something is important, you don't leave it in the hands of others. The green... Builder Hall. Okay. So this is the underground cave. Green ladies primer for children. <laughs> okay. So these are they are using scrolls. The in the green are you up to? King Cameron Elden Elden Rules, okay. A shepherd in Valleywood and beyond. Few sh short months ago.
Okay, I'll come in CD. That that seemed easy. Let the village speak. Be praised. You have a look at a right. Ah, oh, don't. Ah, oh, Ifra's ass. This is amazing. Where did you dig up this relic? It was Spinner Bell Wellis, wasn't it? Canny old goat. Ha! <laughs> what a find. Nice work, traveler. I never even thought to ask him. Brilliant. Go tell the loving couple. In the meantime, I'll gather mint for Nedalia, as many others as I can. If Lainey and Clendigal are going to ask the village to decide, we need the whole village to be present. With the fathers hunting for them, I told Lainey and Clend to hide out. They have a little love nest in an overgrown ruin on the southern love edge nest. of town. I bet they're there. Tell them what you... Then we make for Varen's Wall. Right. From there we head for Anvil. But it's... Oh! Traveler! Hello! I see Cyril found you. This is a happy place for us, Traveler. I hope you've come with news to match. An old scroll. Huh. I've never heard of this before. The Rite of Propagation. We gather some symbols, present them to friends and family, and ask the village what it thinks we should do. Traveler, with this we might not have to leave. The spinner? Hmm. I didn't even know he liked me. Thank you. You have no idea what this means to us. We've been on a blade's edge since we spoke. We've already asked you for so much. If you're willing, do you have time to help us gather our symbols? The Dawnway means so much to me and my family. It draws from alien culture, and there are several alien ruins nearby. A mosaic from the ancient empire of the Heartland Elves would perfectly represent me to the village. How about undead Scala? <laughs> She's been mouthing words at me over your shoulder. Meet her where we began the ceremony to grow Vashabar. She thinks a dormant seed pod will represent her quite well. I'll mark your map and we'll see you beyond the village. Laney, we get to stay! I can't rotten believe it! Can you rotten believe it, Clem? Ha! Uh, the sooner we get those symbols, the faster we can start planning the wedding. Traveler, be careful. Bugs are plenty here. They're drawn to... The ritual still hangs heavy around this place. That's why there are so many sodding bugs. The seed pod we need should be close by. Let's go find one. You should have seen me waving my arms around to get Clen's attention. A seed pod's perfect. The dormant greenspring seeds are what remains of the ritual we use to grow Vashabar. They're sacred to us, carried all the way from Valenwood. If we get to stay and I can continue my training to be a green speaker, it would mean the blighted world to me. I want the village to know I never intended to run away from my calling. That this was only ever about our union, about our love. The ritual you should have seen. We green speakers use ritual magic to enhance their growth. They go from fragile little pods to. Okay. okay now she's following us. over there. Yeah. That's a 
That's a, that's a big wasp. Okay. Okay, not the easiest place to... Whatever is wasps near the green board. I'm here, friend. If you're ready, let's head inside. Okay, let's see where this, this leads. Just slightly smaller. Okay. Mosaic. Okay. That's it, traveler. An alien mosaic that represents me perfectly. Well, it has about the same look. She, she runs about as fast as Guar. Shabar, Laney and Clendigal have returned. Let them be heard. Cyril, what's the meaning of this? Someone explain to me what's going on. Yeah. My brother looks furious. You again. My sister's coking spirit away. Spit it out. Tell me what's going on here. I wrote a propagation. Did you put them up to this? There hasn't been a rite like this enacted since I was a child back in Valenwood. What does my daughter hope to accomplish with this archaic rite? Outrageous. I'll... I'll... I'll drink my jar. <laughs> I'll stand here, I suppose. Neither myth nor I can stand in the way of tradition, even if I don't like it. Vashabar, we need your help. Laney and I want to marry. As you all know, our fathers refuse to support us. And so, we invoke the rite of propagation, an ancient Bosma custom. We gathered these symbols, representations of our roles in the village. An alien mosaic for me. And a green spring seed for me. Friend, you helped us find them. Please bring them forth. These symbols represent our commitment to the village. To each other. Our future lies in whatever you decide. Do we have your support? Well, what do you say, Vashabar? Do you support this union? Aye! Aye. Uh, ha! There it is. Congratulations, you two. Let's give the couple a moment. Drinks for everyone. <laughs> More Cute. Like you, old boss. The village is spoken, so let's make the best of this. I suppose you're right, you bastard. 
you bloodthirsty. We're going to Let's get to drinking like it. Okay, that was easy. This hardly feels real. They rotting stand with us. Oh, singer be praised. I don't know whether to dance or cry. I think I'll do both. After Clen and I have a few of Cyril's potent drinks. I've been tense about this for so long. I almost forgot what it feels like to let go. Let's get through this party first and let the village sober up. A few days, I expect. At most. <laughs> At that will give most. our father's time to become comfortable with the idea. And I can work with Cyril to arrange the handfast ceremony. I can't thank you enough. You and the singer helped us make our dream come true. Without you, who knows where Clen and I would have ended up. I'll pray for you, traveler. If I keep and protect you for all the rest of your days. <laughs> your inventory is full. Uh, I, I was going to say let let's end this on a high note, but inventory is full. Tam, I can't thank you. I can't tell you the last time I've seen Lainey smile like that. Thank you, traveler. You've changed our lives. Okay, that that let's end this on a high note. That that was cute. So I'll I'll end up here. Continue playing. Um, I think we are going to have play retro games in a weekend. Of course, I'm going to po continue the Zelda Scones online because this like this uh, something like a 20 hour campaign uh, on on this um, area. So. Yeah, that thirst needs to be played. But we have lots of retro games I want to show you. So that's that's the general idea. If you're watching this on YouTube, please like and subscribe. And uh, every watch hour helps uh, regardless of the platform you are watching me. YouTube, uh, Twitch, Facebook even. So that's the multi-streamers live. But any, anyway, uh, Drop a note if you can, and remember that there's new uh, uh, points redeems for G uh, Twitch followers that you might well want to check. Anyway, uh, I'll, I'll lock off. Uh, thank you for watching, and we'll continue in the weekend. Happy summer.